you deposit 1,000 into a 9% account today, anong type yan? Anong type of uh, interest yan? That is actual. Okay? Wala siya nakalagay dyan na compounded. At the end of 2 uh, years, you will deposit another 3,000. So, invest ka na invest. At zero tier, naglagay ka daw ng pera. Okay? Nagpasok ka ng pera, lagay mo dito. Baba mo na agad. So, 1K. At the end of 2 years, so 1, 2, nagpasok ka daw ulit ng 3,000. Okay? In 5 years, you plan a purchase of 4,000. So, maglalabas ka ng 4,000. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. On the 5th year, lalabas mo yung 4,000 sa account mo. Palabas eh. 4K. Okay. How much is left into the account one year after the purchase? So, on the 6th year, magkano na lang daw yung nandito sa account mo. Okay. So, this is ilang period yan. So, 4. This, ilang period 2. So, ilang percent yung interest rate mo dyan? 9%. Dito, ibig sabihin, for the entire year, 9% ang growth mo. Okay. So, how will you solve it? Okay. Cash balancing lang to. May hindi ka alam dyan. So, hindi mo alam yun nandito. Tignan mo yung arrows mo. Ilan ang papasok, ilan ang palabas. Okay. Sa lahat mo nang papasok, 1,000. So, yung lahat ng pababa, dapat equal yan sa lahat ng pataas. Okay? So, will become, meron kang pising dito, X. Hindi mo alam yan. Alam mo lang, that after a year, pwede mo pa siyang ma-withdraw. Okay? After this one, balancing. Okay. So, 1,000, ano yung kanyang growth after 2 years? For the 6th year, tignan mo pa rin. Itong 1,000 na to, until the 6th year, pwede pa rin naman yan lumaki yung value niya. Okay? So, ibig sabihin, investment pa rin yan. So, 1 plus 0.09. Unain mo muna yan. For the entire 6th year. Okay? Entire 6th year. So, that is, walang sinabi. So, 1 raised to 6. Plus, yung 3,000 mo na in-invest mo pa. Mag-grow yan from 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 years on the account. So, 1 dito, hindi lang naman dito matut matitigil yung growth ng 1 eh. For the 6th year, ang hahanapin mo dyan ha. For the 6th year, hindi kasama yung 2. Kasi sabi ko, kahit yan mag-deposit ka pa rin ng 3 years, on the second year, yung 1K mo, gumogrow pa rin yan at 1%. For the entire year na kung saan future amount mo is hahanapan mo. So, that is 3,000 1 plus 0.09 divided by 1 raised to 4. Equate na natin. Doon sa inilabas mo na 4,000. At meron pa rin yun interest after 1 year. 1 plus 0.09 over 1 raised to 1. Hindi mo alam yung naging value nung natitira sa'yo. So, you are ought to find yung value ni X. Okay. So, tignan natin yung collective value ni itong dalawa. So, much will be it worth? So, 1,000. 1.09 raised to 6. Plus, 3,000 times 1.09 raised to 4. Okay. So, that is 5,911.844941. Wag nyo munang i-round it off. And then, yung 4,000 nyo, 1 plus 0.09 plus x. So, x will be equal to 5,911.844941. 
minus 4,000 times 1.09. So, after the uh, withdrawal of 4 years, the account will be left with 1,551.84 pesos. Yan na lang yung matitira sa account mo after 4 years. Okay? Basic yan. 